Hello everybody, my name is Tamsang Tyler Ngwalase. I'm known as Tonic. I'm a producer, a music producer specifically. I was born in the Eastern Cape, but now I'm based here in Naisna. I was actually raised here in Naisna. So now I'm full time producing uh, a one uh, a studio that's called Teach You Music. And uh, I'm in charge of people like Z, BBC League. Young Easy, Weasel, uh, work with the uh, Arab. There's a lot, there's a lot. Outrage, outrage too. Outrage too, not forgetting my nigga. Uh, this music thing uh, started a long time ago. Uh, I remember there was an uh, older next door neighbor called Utunuka uh, Konteka. He's the one that first gave me a cassette of Tupac Outlaw and uh, I fell in love with hip hop uh, back then. Then I had friends that did music but I wasn't doing music. At the time I was like into something else and uh, like sports and, and other stuff. So every time they used to come in my house and practice, uh, well, then I look at them and I'm like, nah, man, I can do better than these guys. Uh, well, then the, it happened that we, we we went to the same school, so we vibed together. And when they go to the studio, they they always go with me. So once um, we just worked on a song, and I just started writing. And when I started rapping, and everybody just went crazy, so they were like, "Nah, this this may be something we should check out." Yeah, and I did that. So we started. Um, performing around nice now at the time there was uh, safer schools the municipalities do a lot of events so we had the chance to, to, to perform there but uh, I was forced to quit rapping because my producer back then uh, moved to George because of his personal problems so uh, we didn't have no way to record I was going up and down going to people's houses and harassing them to, 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 to install pretty loops so I can just learn beats. Then something changed when I performed in, 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 in a talent show in, 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 in Pesim Dala. I we were performing there, performing there. And uh, after we performed, this tall guy came to me and, and was like, hey, why not like what you're doing? Eh? Well, I um, just came here in Nice and that guy was Africa. Uh, Africa black and white. Yeah. So yeah. We started then going to his house, making beats there, learning beats. Uh, well, till someday I still remember I wanted my own studio. So my mom organized, as you know, like Africa is like our moms don't make enough money, so it was like a hassle. I have to sacrifice Christmas clothes so I can get the first PC. So I, I hollered at Africa to, to, to just help me out and get that PC. I got a plan. Yeah, only one. Better hit up the block for a bus. When I pull up on you, then you done. So I got my first PC, then with my friend, uh, my best friend Pura is one of the rappers who I work with. Uh, we started to mess around. I remember it was New Year's Eve. We were about to go to the beach. Then we decided, now we're not going. Now we're gonna stay the whole night trying to learn this program. And remember, at that time, it's like we don't even know the the computer itself, like how to run it and, and, and whatever. But we were just learning. So we did that, and uh, we started producing our own songs. We used uh, cheap equipment, like I had that 60 Ren mic apart at Crusaders. Uh, well, then we started that. We didn't know about mixing and mastering. Uh, well, we just wanted to hear ourselves on speakers. Then we carried on. Then we did that. We started to get uh, gigs piece by piece. Then piece by piece, we started growing. Uh, my advice to people that want to produce music or to 
just be in this business or doing something that they love. Uh, I feel like everyone should uh, just follow their hearts. Don't listen to to negativity, because like uh, I come from a small town, so a lot of people told me that with this music you won't go anywhere. You just wait. This is like city people stuff. Now, so you must try and by all means and just follow who you uh, can say to you and also try and, and, and study yourself because you know? sometimes there's talent and the school and they are both important you know? so you gotta choose like wisely and, 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 and you can do it both too there's no there's no saying that you just because you do music you can't study you know? Because sometimes you get skills from, from tertiary schools and then become a better uh, uh, professional in your skills.